the president's failure to put in place a status of forces agreement allowing 10 to 20,000 troops to stay in Iraq? Unthinkable. The precipitous withdrawal uh, is, uh, is unfortunate. It's more than unfortunate. I think it's tragic. He didn't mention Afghanistan, he didn't mention the troops, didn't even thank the troops for their service. Why not say at least a sentence of our gratitude for the young men and women who fought over there in Afghanistan and Iraq? I think that was a mistake. This is to Russia. This is, without question, our number one geopolitical foe. Governor Romney not too long ago said, you know, uh, the Russian Federation is our number one geostrategic threat. Well, it, come on, think. I can't, it, it isn't the case. I also believe the administration was wrong to stand by a statement sympathizing with those who had breached our embassy in Egypt. In times when something violent has happened uh, to your people, I always think discretion is the better way to go. And in the short time you've been here in London, do they look ready to your experienced eye. There are a few things that were disconcerting. If he's here to make uh, friends, he's got a funny way of showing it. It really gives you pause. Anything the Romney camp has done as it relates to foreign affairs uh, is beyond the stumble, it is an embarrassment. Domestic policy, you talk about stuff you don't know anything about, you know, you make, a, make an ass of yourself. You talk, in foreign policy, you start a war.